Welcome back to CAD CAM tutorial. Today we are going to create this simple 3D model in SOLIDWORKS 2016 with the help of 2D drawings. So here we will learn how to use extruded boss base and extrude cut command to create this simple model and we will use utilize fillet command also. I hope you like it. So let's start to create this simple model. This is good example for the beginners. Now let me go to file new and choose here part. Okay now this is solidworks interface here i'll change the background plain white whatever you like to keep from here you can choose whatever background do you like now it's this is our main drawing so let's start to create this one now this is upper one is top view front view and this is side view so we will start with top view you will see 80 by 40 rectangle and it and front view we will see the thickness 10 millimeter then this corner radius you will see 10 millimeters so we will make this one first now let's go to choose extruded boss base here we need to choose which plane we are going to take first so I'll start with top plane now here we will click here center rectangle so that we will we can start from origin point see right click select smart dimension 40 80 by 40 millimeter that's it now simply exit now once you go to exit it will ask you how much do you like to extrude so that is 10 millimeter only we will see here it's 10 millimeter in direction one keep and condition blind okay that's it now let me choose here fillet now corner rectangle it's uh, corner radius it's 10 millimeter if you click the corner radius it will ask you choose all or four corners but we don't want to keep we want to keep only two so click this two edges and here we choose kept constant size fillet and click here symmetric okay Now the next thing we will make this center part you will see this center part this 40 millimeter wide and 20 millimeter above from the upper surface and here one circle R15 so we will create this one then later we will make this wall this see this wall thickness 10 millimeter and height same and corner radius here 8 millimeter so let's make these two things now I will select back side a sketch normal now here we will create so what we will do corner rectangle and I'll draw a rectangle twenty millimeter forty millimeter that's it now select the center point hold shift key and origin point vertical relation now it is in center position either you can draw circle from here see this radius 15 means diameter 30 millimeter now it's time to trim unnecessary lines so you will see here trim entities click and click here power trim just press your left mouse key and drag see okay now create some relation so that it will not it is already collinear okay again let me define this 15 okay then center point choose this center point and origin point vertical if you are not able to find click here fully defined sketch calculate now it is fully defined okay that's it extrude now we want to extrude up to 35 millimeter but this is going reverse direction so just simply click here reverse direction so it will come forward even you can uh, move by your uh, cursor also so 35 millimeter 
keep result merge so that this will be one body if you uncheck you will get two bodies so we want to keep here one okay now that's it now again i'll go to the same sketch normal even in one sketch also we can make the same thing that's not the big deal corner rectangle now let's make one two and three collinear that's it now select this line and this line collinear relation now it is collinear relation now it is fully defined this sketch you can extrude 10 mm it is going back side just click reverse and make it forward okay that's it now this corner radius uh, r8 okay this radius 8 mm and inside there is a circle and that is diameter 8 mm so we will make this holes and bottom also there is hole and uh, this hole is 10 mm uh, no this hole also 8 mm but this is the center of this fillet now you can directly choose fillet click 8 mm and i'll choose this corner and this corner okay select the same surface or plane A sketch normal now let me draw circles you will find if you keep your cursor here you will find the center point see i'll move circle here i'll find a center point now this define this diameter 8 mm right click select now select both the circles and create one relation select one by one hold shift key and equal see this drawing is fully defined extruded cut now here either you can keep blind and whatever thickness you want to choose or even you can select here through all and you have one more op there are many options next even up to surface if you choose up to surface select back sur surface see it's going to cut up to this surface okay oh that's it select bottom face the sketch normal now the same circle we need to make here now select both the circles equal relation A smart dimension and this diameter 8 mm let's confirm once again okay this diameter 8 mm okay let me choose here extruded cut and i'll keep this time and condition through all okay see this is how we created a simple 3d object 3d model in solid works with the help of 2d drawing even if we like to change the color real view graphics here we have multiple number of choices in appearance either you can apply plastic gray blue plastic see it looks nice even if you like to go metal steel polished steel this is carbon steel but that's better go to one 
one kind of plastic or even you can apply here solid oh that's also no look nice this is i like so this is the simple tutorial for the beginners those who want to learn solid works i hope you like it don't forget to share and like our video and please subscribe our channel for more video and more projects in solid works thanks for watching